Hi, this is Mr. Mike. Hi, Mr. Mike. Do you know what time it is? It's circle time with Mr. Mike. Are you ready for some fun? Here we go. Hello, everybody. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hello, everybody. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. My dog, Arlene. Faster. Hello, everybody. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hello, everybody. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. My dog, Arlene. You know, one of my favorite stories to read in the spring is this one, The Very Hungry Caterpillar by Eric Carle. Let's follow along. The Very Hungry Caterpillar by Eric Carle. In the light of the moon, a little egg lay on a leaf. One Sunday morning, the warm sun came up, and pop! Out of the egg came a tiny and very hungry caterpillar. He started to look for some food. On Monday, he ate through one apple, but he was still hungry. On Tuesday, he ate through two pears, but he was still hungry. On Wednesday, he ate through three plums, but he was still hungry. On Thursday, he ate through four strawberries, but he was still hungry. On Friday, he ate through five oranges, but he was still hungry. On Saturday, he ate through one piece of chocolate cake, one ice cream cone, one pickle, one slice of Swiss cheese, one slice of salami, one lollipop, one piece of cherry pie, one sausage, one cupcake, and one slice of watermelon. That night, he had a stomach ache. The next day was Sunday again. The caterpillar ate through one nice green leaf, and after that he felt much better. Now he wasn't hungry any more, and he wasn't a little caterpillar any more. He was a big, fat caterpillar. He built a small house called a cocoon around himself. He stayed inside for more than two weeks. Then he nibbled a hole in the cocoon, pushed his way out, and he was a beautiful butterfly. The End Hi, Goofy. Well, hello, Mr. Mike. Hey, Goofy, I wanted to share with the kids some things I like to eat when I get hungry. Well, it looks like you got a red apple and a yellow banana. That's right. Do you like to eat those two? Oh, I sure do. Hey, I have a funny song about apples and bananas. Would you like to hear it? Sure. Okay, Goofy, let's hear it. guitar music too. Boy, boy, to eat, eat, eat apple and bananas. Yeah. I like to eat, eat, eat apple and bananas. Why? I like to eat, 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 eat apple and bananas. That's silly. I like to eat. I'm going to eat, 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 eat
looked at my watch. I think it's time to go home and check my messages. Well, that sounds like a good idea. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, Goofy. Hi. Welcome to my home. Do you have a place in your home where you like to sit? Well, I like to sit and relax in my big red chair right here. And I'm checking my messages so I'm going to answer a few right now. Ah, I got a message from my friend Herman, who's a busy bee from Toddler Tree. And he asks, Mr. Mike, what happened to the papayas? Well, let me tell you, they fell down. They got so heavy that they broke the stem. Look, these are the papaya that made the plant so heavy it broke the stem. Let's count how many there were. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten papaya. Let me show you. Here's one and here's two. Are they the same or different? They are different. One is small and one is big. But are they good to eat? Well, let's check and see what one looks like from the store. Are they the same or different? They're really different. Let me show you this one because we cut it open to eat it. Look at the inside, full of seeds. Do we eat the seeds? No, we take the seeds out before we cut up the orange part to eat. That's the best part. So Herman, what we did with those little papayas, we're going to turn them into mulch. Mulch is something we can use in our garden. Okay? Thank you for your question. Let's check the next message. Hmm. My buddy Nicholas from San Diego sent a video question. Mike, do you like to ride a bike? Yes, I really like to ride a bike. Look at me on the trail in this video. Another message was from Jose Luis. He's my friend. He sent me a video of him in his house showing us how he made an echo. Remember what we sang the other day? Little Sir Echo, how do you do? Hello, hello, 
Hello. Hello. He made an echo to show us. Thank you, Jose Luis. If you have a question for Mr. Mike, post it on Instagram and put hashtag Ask Mr. Mike. What did we learn today? Well, we heard some sounds of spring. We saw how a caterpillar turned into a butterfly. And then we had a treat with apples and bananas. Which one do you like best? Apples or bananas? By the way, if you liked having fun with Mr. Bike, then just put a like at the bottom and subscribe to this channel. Oh no, it's time to go. Oh, so we no. have to say, Goodbye, everybody. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Goodbye, everybody. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. My dog, Harley. Goodbye, everybody. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Goodbye, everybody. Yes, sir. See you soon.